Yeah, it's okay. Step in, please. Step in. Thank you so much for coming in today. Uh, thank you for coming in on time. Excellent, excellent. I just happen to have your your file here, and I see that you are scheduled for a full for a full body physical examination. Am I correct with that saying that? Okay, excellent. And okay, uh, can you actually just let me know what was the last time uh, you were at this office? Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. And uh, tell me, uh, since the last time that you were here, have you had any, any, uh, any problems? As in, you went to the emergency room, any kind of fractures, problems, surgeries, anything of that sort? Okay. Got it. And I know that it's getting warm outside. It's, you know, it's, it, it, we're in the summertime. So I do ask, uh, have you have any problem with allergies? Okay. Are you taking any kind of medication for allergies at all? Okay. Uh, any feeling a bit of a runny nose, anything like that? Maybe a little, a little tingly nose. Okay, and what about your throat? A little scratchy, a little itchy. Uh, sometimes maybe a little, a little sore. Okay. Got it. Okay. Okay, so uh, I do see here that on the form you did uh, put down that the reason for your visit is that you find medical examinations very relaxing and they help you sleep. Uh, are you having issues sleeping at this moment? Well, not at this moment while you're here. I mean, at home. <laughs> okay, I got it, I got it. <laughs> okay, gotcha. Okay, and by any chance, do you happen to be drinking an excessive amount of caffeine? Whether it is early in your day or maybe closer to the time that you go to sleep. Okay, gotcha. Okay, so uh, that's going to be all the questions for now. I know it's a lot, but I just want to be a little thorough. Um, so today I am going to be doing an examination where I'm going to be doing a lot of different things. Um, we're going to be doing a lot of detail work here. Um, mostly because I did see, well, since you wrote that, uh, medical exams are relaxing to you. So I do thank you for coming in to um, to the Hit Tingles Clinic. And I hope that you enjoy your time here. I am Dr. Hit, and I will be taking care of you today. So uh, before I do begin, I do ask please that you do move up in the chair. I do see that you're a little bit moved to the back. Yeah, just like that, just move to the front and I'm standing right in front of you. Can you uh, please just try to square up with me so that you're perfectly uh, lined up with me? Just like that. Perfect. Okay. And while... I'll give myself a second to, to get my gloves on. Um, are you feeling nervous by any chance? Or do you normally feel nervous coming to the doctor's office? Gotcha. Well, don't you worry. We're not. I'm not going to do anything that's going to cause any kind of harm or any kind of pain. I might press a little bit on a particular body part today. I might uh, just tap you with a hammer. But other than that, other than that slight discomfort that you might feel at any given moment, it's not going to be anything that lasts more than maybe half a second. Excellent. So, before I do begin with the examinations, I will be uh, checking your temperature just to see if you're maybe feeling a little bit warm or maybe if you're a little bit under the weather, a little under the temperature. Okay? So, if you will please. 
please uh, to get you just lean forward just a little bit. Thank you. And thank you. Okay. And I'm just going to do that one more time just to be 100% sure. Excellent. Good. You should feel, you should feel actually a little bit more relaxed after doing that. Okay, excellent. Yeah, it usually uh, just rid the body a little bit of stress and anxiety. So, e excellent exercise to do at home, even if um, you're obviously not taking an exam at home. But if you are at home and you feel a little bit anxious or nervous, inhale through your nose, out through your mouth, in with the good, out with the bad. Okay, excellent. Okay, let me out. Uh, Take a quick note here. Okay. Feeling all right so far? Okay, excellent. I'm gonna go ahead and just feel around the uh, your throat area right around here, okay? If you allow me to touch, and as well as I'm gonna go ahead and touch along your jawline, okay? And right around the sides of your face, okay? So, you will. Just go ahead and I'll just start out with this side. Um, 
are you feeling any kind of pain or maybe a little bit of discomfort? Okay. Gotcha. All there. Very well, very well. And let me go ahead and take a look at this side as well. Let me just go and grab this. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and now check your eyes, all right? switch eyes for me. 
great job. All right, so let's go ahead and do the same thing. Once again, you can close your eye with your hand or just, uh, you know, close it with, <laughs> just close it yourself, you know? Okay, so if you will please, uh, I need you to look at the light right here. Good job. And please look straight up for me. Just look straight up. That's all you're doing right now. Very good. Very good. And now, please look to your left. No, no. Wrong way. Your left, not mine. Very good. Very good. Okay. And now look to the right. Very good. Very good. Now I'm going to ask you to once again... I'm just going to hold up your eyelid right here, okay? And you're just going to look at the light again. And look straight down. Very good, very good. Now, let's go ahead and grab this. Now, if you will, please, please look at the pen. Okay, good. Now, I just want you to follow the pen. Very good. Very good. Good job. Excellent. Go relax now. You did well. You did well. Doing very well so far. Okay. So, um, as you can see right here in the corner, uh, this will be the last portion of your eye exam. Well, the eye testing part. Uh, what I'm going to ask you, please, is to cover your left eye. Very good. And if you could, please read line number four. One, two, three, four. Read line number four. Very good job. Very good. And if you will, now, can you cover your other eye? Very good. And now, can you please read line three? Good. Now, I am going to... Let's see. I'm going to point at a few letters and you can have, no, I, yeah, I'm going to want you to have one eye closed so you, you can remain with that eye closed right now. I'm just going to point at a few and you just let me know what the letter is, okay? So, what letter is this? Okay, and what about, let's say, this one right here. Okay, and one more. Let's say that one. Very good job. Very good. Now, you can go ahead, please, and switch I. Good. And now, if you will, Please go ahead and let me know what letter is this. Very good, very good. And now, if you could, what letter is that? Very good. And one more. What letter is that? Good job. Well, um, 
I'm just going to ask you to please just look forward and try not to move around too much, okay? So, um, you'll excuse me. Let's go ahead and take a look here. side is Interesting, interesting. Okay. Good. You could go ahead and relax. I do have a question. Um, have you, by any chance, uh, recently bit your cheeks? Okay, because I did see a little bit of, um, I guess, teeth mark on the side of your cheeks inside. So I just wanted to ask.
does the light being so close to you bother you? One. And two, does at any point anywhere on your face cause any kind of pain? Okay. So, I'm going to start out at the top and I'm going to move side to side. Okay. So, this is on your forehead. discomfort okay so now I'm going to cross your eyes I'm going to cross your eyes just like this I'm going to go straight down your nose okay that's like that yeah it's a little silly I know but it's just to see if there's any pain or discomfort okay very good. Okay, was there any pain on any of those section on that T we just ran? Okay, now I'm going to move on the side over here just like this, okay? So, just like that, yes.
Very good job. Very good. Okay. Very good. Excellent. And now, um, what I'm going to ask of you right now is I'm going to just take a swab of your saliva and we're going to go ahead and send it to the lab and see if, um, see what you are allergic to and what you are not. Okay, so I'm just going to ask you to please open your mouth for me and I'm just going to swab it on each side, okay? So, go ahead. Good. There we go. And a little bit on this side. And a little bit on this side. Excellent. Okay. So let's go ahead and you give me one moment, please. Let me go ahead and place this over here. Excellent. Let's go ahead and just put this right on there. There we are. That thing can be a little loud sometimes. <laughs> so, uh, where was I? Okay. Okay. So, I'm just going to um, take a look at the muscles on your face your shoulder muscles, okay? And then I'm going to check out your joints. So what I'm going to ask that you do for me right now is I just want you to go ahead and relax your face. So I just want you to look at me straight, just like this. Good, and now give me a great big smile without opening your mouth. So I want you to do this. Good, and now give me a great big smile with your teeth. Very good, very good. And can you give me an ah? Uh, good, good. And can you please lift your eyebrows? Good, and now furl them. Good, and now with just your head, I want you to please look in this direction. So I want you to go like this. Okay, as far as you can. Very good, and back. Good job. And now we're gonna go the other way. So you're gonna do that as far as you can. Very good, and now you're going to look straight up. Very good, and now I want you to tuck your chin. Good, now this part is very crucial, and I actually really need you to I need you to actually do this and I need you to focus on doing it as long as you possibly can, okay? Even if afterwards you keep your eyes closed, that's okay. So what I'm going to ask you to do is I'm going to ask you to blink as quickly as you can until your eyes are tired and you leave your eyes closed, okay? Once they're closed, just leave them closed and do not open them for a, for a moment. Okay, I'll let you know when to open them. So go ahead. Go ahead and do it. Okay. Very good. your eyes are closed, I am going to use a tuning fork. And I want you to let me know on what side you hear the tuning fork. You're going to raise your hand, depending on the side that you hear it on, okay? So, here we go. Very good, very good. Very good. 
listening for the buzz, not not really the ding, just the buzzing near your ears, okay? Very good. And now I'm going to use one. This is a very low decibel one. Yeah, it's very difficult to hear. So if you can hear it, please make sure to lift the corresponding side's arm, okay? Okay, so here we go. Okay. And one more time. Water very close to your bedtime, it might 
make you want to get up after you've fallen asleep and break up your sleep cycle. Okay. Very well, very well. Okay. Okay. So, um, I don't see any particular reason why you should be having difficulty sleeping. Um, another thing that you might want to take a look at, it might be your nutrition. Um, try to see if, if it's possible that maybe you're a little bit deficient in potassium. If you're a little bit deficient in potassium, it's possible that uh, it's causing you not to be able to sleep, fall asleep when you want to fall asleep. Uh, it is a little bit difficult to come by. Don't worry, it's not just bananas to have them. Many fruits have them, but, but, but bananas do have quite a bit. Try to have a little bit more bananas if it's possible, if you're not allergic to that. Otherwise, everything seems okay. Um, everything seems okay. I don't see any other issues. Um, you seem like you're perfectly healthy with the exception of your heart. Um, I do, I would like to see a little bit more physical activity from you. See if we can bring that resting heart rate a little down. But, um, other than that, it seems like you are in tip-top condition. So, with that said, I am Dr. Hit, and as always, it was a pleasure taking care of you.